Hey, what's up, Dallas? This is Rachel. I have here with Tom Henderson. He just got signed with Icon Studios as an actor, and I just wanted to go a little bit in depth on how his whole process is of how he got there. So, Tom, tell me how you got into the whole acting business. Well, you know, to be honest with you, it was um, it was a step of faith. It was a dream that I thought was long dead, and. Uh, Early last year, uh, in, it was last spring. In fact, it just started getting really heavy in my heart that desire again, and I and I uh, I just li I literally told God, God, I don't want this. If this is you, you got to do something with it. And um, I said that, and He put in uh, my heart to talk to my old acting coach. Mm -hmm. Her name is Rosanna Rizzo, and uh, so I, I called her up. I hadn't talked to her in eight years. And uh, she's a, a spiritual believer, and as as she was talking to me, she started praying, and immediately five things came to her spirit to share with me. And uh, in a week and a half, I was in front of the camera for the very first time ever. That's so amazing. That's, yeah, that's quite a, that's quite a journey on how to get there. So you you didn't want to do acting at first, and then you just felt the calling, or what? No, I didn't want the disappointment of nothing happening, but having that deep hunger oh gotcha. again I, I've, I've i've dreamed about this ever since i was a kid mm -hmm. and the last time i'd actually done any real acting was in uh when i did some theater in in uh, college that's awesome yeah. i mean acting is a, i mean i feel like in order to act you have to want to act it's not just something yes. that you can pull off naturally yes yes yeah so that's very cool well when i was a kid the television was my babysitter and, and and so my life was surrounded by the movies and and uh, and TV and in in a very real way, the characters that I saw on television they were my friends, you know. And uh, and and it's it's a very interesting aspect to to realize. But uh, you know, I knew this is where I belong. Oh yeah, of course. Well, I mean, I've seen you perform on the screen. And I think you're just absolutely talented. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yes. I, I think you could pull off, like I said before, the Sherlock Holmes, you know, mm -hmm. his sidekick. I mm -hmm. think you could pull that off really quick. It's elementary. It's elementary, it's elementary. my dear Watson. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Tom, how do you feel about being signed with Icon Studios? That is also a dream come true. I had wanted uh, that opportunity for the last eight months, mm -hmm. and I knew it was supposed to be. Mm -hmm. And but the doors never opened, and mm -hmm. so I just decided to wait and um, and uh, see what would happen. And then this opportunity with under protection opened the door. That's amazing. And uh, and at the right time, it's all about timing. It at is. the right time, Normita gave me a call and said, "I want to sign you," and uh, and opened the door for me to get connected with a uh, another class and. Um, and so things are just moving right along. That's great. Has she already got your first assignment with Icon Studios? Not yet. Not I'm yet. I'm still getting my uh, maybe steps. Uh, yeah, I'm getting my my uh, my photos together for the page and everything, and so it'll be coming in a week or two. That's wonderful. Yeah. And how about how about your experience with Under Protection? How did you feel about that movie in general? Just being a part of it. Just being a part of it. Well, I mean, I was. It's like being home, you know, where you belong. And then, of course, it was on the set of Under Protection is where you and I met. Mm -hmm. And I absolutely <laughs> love it. Yeah. Um, I, you know, I've made so many good friends. Mm -hmm. Lifetime friends. Mm -hmm. You know. I agree. And, uh, it, you know, that was it was life changing from, from beginning to end. I love the making of it. Mm -hmm. I love the releasing of it. And oh my goodness, our premiere the other week, it was it was the most amazing thing. Because I can honestly say, I, you know, I made three films. Mm -hmm. I was in three films last year. Yep. But Under Protection was the first one to be actually be released. Yes. And so, out of all the premieres that I've, I've, I've come to this theater for, mm -hmm. that was the first one I could actually come to say and say, I'm in a movie. Uh, and it's and out. So, and yes. it's out. And you can watch it. <laughs> When I saw my name in the credits mm -hmm. at the premiere, I, I got teary-eyed because I'm looking at, that's my name up there. Yes. 
you know. Exactly. And so at that moment, I'm like, God, you've delivered on a promise. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So, and here you are. And here I am. Pushing for that dream. Absolutely. Now, Tom, I'm going to flip this interview around. Is there any questions you want to ask me? You get to be the interviewer now. Okay. I get to be the interviewer now. What was your impression our first day on set? Our first day on set? I did not even know you were in the movie until, I, until you told me. <laughs> right. I recognized the FBI badge. Oh, um, right. Yeah, so uh, my first impression of Tom was that he was just sitting there relaxing. He was sitting in a chair on set, and I just... Uh, I thought it was really uh, nice of him. He just told me I could sit down next to him because it was really cold outside and I didn't want to sit outside. I was waiting for my part to come up. And I mean, me and Tom, we just struck up a really nice conversation and we just like started bonding ever since then. And, and Tom's become a really good friend of mine now. So he's a great actor. And uh, yeah, I mean, I, I didn't realize that such a simple action or conversation would spawn a good friendship. All right. But it's always the simple thing. Yes. Yes. So that was my first impression. <laughs> it, that day for me is like I realized I found my tribe. Mm -hmm. you gotta um, have your tribe. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and Tom's always surrounded by the pretty girls. <laughs> That's true. You are. That is very true. You are. <laughs> yes. So, do you have any more questions? Get to pick my brain this time. What is your aspiration? What do you want to accomplish in this industry? Oh, that's a really good question. And also a loaded question. Um, <laughs> okay. So my goal uh, is to be an actress, but also using that platform and that outlet to reach more people in the business and the entertainment industry. So, um, so far, I think I have lined up about six different projects okay. in the works but nice. haven't started any of them except for under protection which already came out and um ever since then i've connected with a, a lot of actors uh comedians a lot of uh, directors producers uh videographers and also just you know a lot of businesses in general so I'm kind of taking What's Up Dallas Magazine and the acting industry and kind of putting it all together to nice. open more doors. Nice. So that's my big goal. Yes. Okay. I just want What's Up Dallas to be successful and to make a difference and continue to grow. That's what I want to do. It's an amazing tool you have there. One day I'll figure out a way to get in your magazine. Okay. All right <laughs> now. I'll, ha I'll probably have an actor's portion so we can talk about that. All right. Yes. So, hey, Tom. So thank you for your time today. My I appreciate pleasure. it, and we'll uh, we'll be updating you on some more talent later on. But Tom, thank you so much. I appreciate you. <laughs>